Hey everyone, welcome back to Outbreak Gaming. I'm Tony here. We're back with some Solaris with the Rontas uh, Federation. So, yeah, I've come to realize that uh, we uh, focused a lot on you know our planets and what we we're gonna do, but I've kind of forgot that we still had to do a mission. The which one is it? This one, the Throne of God. Here we go. So we gotta do Mayas. The only way we can do Mayas though is going through their system. Thank you, AI. I can't really make it in here because, well, we're kind of not friends. <laughs> so, yeah, that's a that's a little issue that we have here. Uh, wow, Frontier Outpost actually cost us some uh, influence. That's interesting. Huh. Um. So, which one? If we were to declare war, would we go against them or them? They have some very nice minerals, so hmm. I can't even. I don't even know. So how do I know that they're making seven? Interesting. I know there's six somewhere in there. Or would we go against them? They only have three planets, and I can see that they only have like specific. Uh, there's a nebula there, so it's gonna slow us down. Nebula. Where does the nebula end? Is the nebula still here? Uh, I don't know. So I think, I don't know, I may have to stay away from, you know, getting into any form of a war. Mostly because I don't think we're ready for it. I, um, right now we have a battle going on. That's where we left off in our last episode. So let's go ahead and finish this battle. Or really start it, I guess. Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna pause it real quick because I do have a few um two of my science ships just doing nothing okay so you're there uh, go research that survey sorry the guy in, uh, we have one over here with us I think and he's gonna be the one scanning uh, yeah go ahead and survey the system or no uh, survey the system survey the system from there go or just survey here and then, you know, go do your thing. There you go. That's a little better. All right, back to the battle. I mean, our fleet is kind of powerful, yes. But if we can get bonuses from, like, you know, finding those ships, and they probably can too. So, I don't know. We do spend a good amount, you know, in ship, ma in ship maintenance. So, there is that to account for. And I think we're paying more the higher they da get damaged, I think. Interesting. Food for thought. We will hopefully survive without losing any ships. Throughout our surveys of habitable wars, our biologists have collected a vast amount of data on alien, af on alien life forms. Many of our old theories on the development of life have been disapproved, and our scientist community has to build new models from scratch. Our most interesting findings are being displayed at the newly dedicated Museum of Ex Exobi Exobiology on the Ronts Prime. The public is enthralled, and many donations have come in to aid. Ooh, huge research bonuses, actually. Wow, that's awesome. Sweet. That's so cool. So, yeah. It's really interesting. It's firing, like, crystals or something. I don't know. Yeah, so we m almost came to losing one ship. All right, let's get all of you repaired. Go home. Uh, I'm going to send that science ship. Which one's down here? Can I not rename my own ships? Because that's really annoying if I can't. I wish I could rename the science ships. Um, I know I can rename you guys, so we're gonna name you the Federation Fleet. Federation Fleet, because really I don't really have anything else to name. Um, where is our science, our our construction ship? Yeah, so you're down there. Okay, so you're up here actually. Um, two science bonus, eh, maybe. Counting that we have that uh, uh colony going, we're still making money. So, may oh, three energy credits, maybe? No, we're doing fine with our energy credits. We're actually starting to near our limit. That's some kind of being a bit, uh, you know, slowing down with it. How about here? I really do want to take this one. Two and two, actually, never mind. Uh, where else? Here, maybe? Two and two for society, maybe. Um, looking for any really minerals. Maybe here? 
So we're getting a three here. Maybe build another one here. Might as well, right? Let's go ahead and build it there. Uh, minor station. It'll pay for itself in a bit. Yeah, let's do it. Maybe up here, actually, since we don't really have anything here. Build it here. Yeah, there you go. I wonder if that cancels the previous project of building it here. I think it does, because I think it gave me my money back. <laughs> so, you know, next goal might be to put one here. Take all of this. Or maybe I could put it up here so that I can use this planet that's habitable. How good is it? Oh, it's a tiny planet. That's right. Mm. But there is three and three minerals, so that alone could make it worth it. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Another thing I could do is just put like a science one down here, another uh, frontier here, so I could block them from moving anywhere. That might be something I do in the future, and then another one here maybe. Hmm. I don't know. We'll have to see. Because here they are blocked. Um, the only way they can move is through. Yeah, they can't move past us. Because if they go here, they can't go to any of these. If they can go here anymore, that's ours and their limits stops here. And you know that's why I kind of want to block them here so that I can start calling all of this mine. Ah, but I really do want to move up here before they take it. That would probably piss them off. There is a Batarian stone there, so that's definitely worthy. Uh, system surveyed. Okay. All right. How's our military fleet doing? Okay, so they're going home. They're going to get repaired. After that, I might send you up here to Pidram and, you know, take them out. Just because I don't like, you know, enemies in our systems. Because it is ours. Uh, science update. Yeah, we're doing that. Okay, we still haven't seen more of the ships, so. Yeah, we're just kind of waiting right now. Um, getting some more money, pretty much. Trying to get our uh, minerals going up, because we need them. That's really our limiting factor right now. How are we doing in our worlds? More food production. Hmm. Have we finished the swamp research? Because I really want to start removing those. No, we're close to it though, in three months. So that's really cool to see. There's a lot of things I can upgrade, but I don't think we need to upgrade anything yet. Pause. Uh, nothing really I want to give up for that, so. Maybe here? Spelling slumps. Eh. I don't think we would need to build anything yet in our home for right now. Might build a spaceport actually. Start focusing on that, but they are really expensive, and I want to build that once we have, you know, better uh, resource production. So there you go. We're about to finish this one here. Oh, where was it? Uh, which system was it? I think it was here. Oh, we don't have a governor here. We need a governor. Every planet of ours needs a governor. Clear block cost and time. Mm. Physics, engineering, and society output. Eh, not the best, actually. So I'm going to go ahead and hire you, I guess. And I'm going to put you wherever we have the most, you know, blocks that we can remove at least. So maybe here? I think it'll be here because uh, we do have a few there. Actually, maybe here. Yeah, let's put you here. Happiness, construction, blocker. Cool. Uh, Ecuador available. So here you go. It does increase their happiness by a little bit and their construction time. So that's always a nice bonus. And then we're going to need another one for you, so. Stone Age Primitives and Asteroid Impacts. Minerals plus five. Cool. Okay, so that's a dense jungle, so I won't be able to remove those. It's a shame, but, you know. Up here, dense jungle, another one. Dang. So this is the ones we can remove. The Noxious Swamp here will soon. I'm looking for the food. So here we have the two food from that. So they're almost, they're getting near, you know, finishing. Uh, what else? What can I build? Any ships that we should improve or anything? Uh, this is our fighting corvette, our pharaoh, constructor, corvette, 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 Mexico. I'm going to delete this one just because, you know, it was kind of dumb. Uh, okay, so our Mexico design. Ooh, fire rate, weapons damage ship hole and chance to evade oh, that is so cool I think we're gonna do fire rate though weapon sandwich and fire rate interesting so we have gotten a few updates actually to our ships this one does 599 damage and it has 50 laser or 50 shields and very good evasion actually I like it uh, what about the Doolittle that's always gonna be our Doolittle 
science lab. I can't really change that. I'm going to change that to that in case we make any more uh, shields. I did add shields because why not? So there's only one core anyway. Uh, new design. Uh, Corvette. Um, I want to see the medium one. So this has two medium utilities. Okay, so let's try this one, right? So space torpedoes. Oh, oh god. Okay, so go back to the, this one. So space torpedoes versus nuclear missiles versus red lasers, right? So 2.51, 1. Point, oh god, they are so much better. I wonder how they do as a medium. So uh, let's pick this one. Space torpedoes. Five damage. Uh, 754 damage. Oh, that is awesome. We're going to change it over to fire rate. Oh my god, yes, that is awesome. Uh, we're going to need some serious power to, you know, get this thing moving. So nanocomposite composite armor. Okay, so uh, fusion reactor. The more advanced one. Okay, so I can fit. Okay, so I need two of them. Uh, deflectors can fit one. I can only fit one. Dang. So now to composite maybe? Okay, so it's not too bad. 6% damage reduction. Not really... Are we researching the next uh, core? No, we aren't. Uh, I, I like it. It's going to be very powerful, but it's not really as what I wanted. I wanted more of a... more defensible. Like, you know, more shield, but... Um... Cost, chance to evade. So it actually does increase their chance to evade just by adding that. Thrusters, 20, 30. Interesting. Can make it like a very evasive ship, maybe. Because it does it does add some com uh, hull points, too. But I think fire rate, because you're more of a firing ship. I don't know. I think we're going to save it, and, you know, we'll update it later. Um, what should we name it? countries that's right i'm going to use countries until um uh, if you guys want to be part like a name on the ship or a planet or uh anything really just go ahead and comment what you want to be and just you know your name what you want to be called unless you you can just say my youtube name or whatever and i'll just go ahead and use your name so if you want that guys just go ahead and leave a comment and you know i'll i'll make sure to uh add you guys into the series so for now you're gonna be i think i already named one america didn't i you know, i named you mexico so this is gonna be america because you know big torpedoes america there we go. Save. I do want to try uh, another ship. So if we go into shifter, I think it is. Two medium slots. So maybe this one's going to be our defense one. So autocomplete. Let's see what it does for us. Yeah. Uh, how about this? Focus it more on, you know, defense. So 75 shields, evasion 30. Not the most powerful, true, but it can take some. it can take a punch. Okay, so let me fix, let's see if I can make it better. Um, so, you know, this, uh, let's see, one medium deflector, one small, we're at negative 30, and I think we can fit that bill actually very well. Hmm. So if I were to do all three of those, and then two, you don't even need that, you can have just a normal. Yeah, so. So 75 shields, shield regeneration 1.2. So 75 shields, let's see, what if I put two mediums? One, two, three. There we go, that's better. 100 shields, why not? Yeah, let's do it. Uh, so this is going to be our, our shield one, maybe the Britain, the British. There we go. The Britain didn't sound right in my head, so I just kind of change it to the the Britain. Uh, there's really nothing I can add to you. Nothing really I can add, actually. No point in really giving you anything. Maybe advanced thrusters just to kind of, you know, make it... 15. How much do you give? I wish it told me, like, in that s screen, you know, but... 15. There you go. Perfect. Power zero. Fine. Yep. Oh. Yeah, I overwrite that. Nothing really I want to change though. Hyperdrive. Maybe there's better hyperdrives on the down the road. No point in adding like a better, you know, system to you. Although it's not really costing me anything. It's not really adding to the cost, apparently. Eh, we'll just keep it there. Alright, so we went ahead and update our, our uh ships. Let's see. What else? Almost done with this. I'm gonna go ahead and speed it up a little more. 
our ships are you know going home get themselves repaired I'm interested to see how they're uh, okay so focus on this one are your shields not getting you know oh you don't have shields the Pharaoh class I might have to start deleting these actually so uh, delete or yeah disband disband so I'm gonna get rid of these may get rid of that one actually but not for right now for right now I just wanna not the mining station uh, there you go oh it immediately deletes them for me interesting that was gonna you know put him elsewhere oh that's fine though uh where are you so go to the next one and then this one's gonna start uh researching the entire system i think which i think it's a what it's doing actually so great cheers so now it's not doing anything in jaeger Are you done serving the system? There you go. Whoa. Investigate Moo Aliens. Moo Aliens. Oh, for a minute I thought that we had found, like, you know. Oh my god. Robolo's VM mining station. Holy hell. That's a lot of them. We're gonna get out of here, actually. Um. Yeah, so. Thank you. Jesus Christ, this AI. Research it. I want to know if they're dangerous or not. What the hell? Are they just a cloud? Oh, they're they're jumping in a hyperdrive. I think. Bye-bye. Or they're landing, maybe? This vessel has own capabilities. Yeah, obviously. I like how it tells me how much power they have, though. That's a little bit silly. If you think about it. Now we're going to send you guys to go fight them, the pirate station, just to get rid of it. I want to see how, you know, a station battle, I think we've seen a, a station battle actually, when we saw the, uh, what was it, they were fighting against, uh, I'm trying to remember, Corvette Assembly Yards and Spaceport Level 2, cheers guys, um, projectile, no, defense module, maybe though, Ceramo Metal Armor, so it's the next level of, hmm. Minerals plus 5%. 30 plus 5%. 10 plus 5%. Or let up, I guess. Um, we're going to do power exoskeletons just so we can get it. It's going to be quick anyway, so we have very good uh, bonuses to our engineering. 32. Oh my god, we make so much. What about over here? We're making... Busy with space. Oh. Uh... So this one's making 1165. That's not too bad. Cool. I don't know. We I canceled a lot of our um, influence points, and I focused them more on you know research. But I think that's fine. I think it's worth it. Balances it out because it does give a 20 bonus to each uh, research. Since growing at about one per month. So like, how do I know? Oh yeah, I can check the food needed. That's how much surplus we have, so. So you, you have to keep in the end a certain balance of food anyway, so. Encounter with primitives. Society research is gained here. Oh, but this is so large, like there's so much to it. Reservations. Enslave the savages. Ooh, that is awesome. That is so cool. Happiness is zero. Member of the serfs faction enslaved. Is there any food? No. Hmm. Can they work in food? Or can they only work in a... Population modifiers, happiness minus ten. I don't I don't it represents a chance that this bubble will change ethics. A negative number means that the population will like confirm to the end. It's so negative is a good thing. Okay, that's good. So do I just wait for their happiness to go up or Whoa, so many okay, so happiness base sixty, 
Stellar Culture Shock, minus 10. Enslaved, minus 30. Cynophilia. Slavery allowed. Purge allowed. What's purge? I think it's killing them all. Systematically decimate. Yeah, I don't want to do that. I'm going to remove the purge. I don't really need the purge. Uh, Senos. From other species. Yeah, I'm going to do prohibited. I don't really want that negative modifier. And does that help a little at least? Migration. <laughs> so like, yeah, I guess I found how to get slaves. Um, Migration. Free migration. Sure. Yeah, that's fine. I don't see why we couldn't have that. Um, leadership, primary speech, only can't really change that, I think. Native inter interference and restricted. Collectivist regime won't well, suck it. So, I mean, I'm changing some things to try to, like, you know, make them a little happy. Sharing our knowledge, we can actively encourage natives to take their rightful place in the galactic community. Uh, sure. Native interference. Active study. The unlock observation stage can perform most type of studies. Cannot invade native worlds. Cannot invade native worlds. Can invade native worlds. Okay, well, yeah, we need that. Uh, anything else that's like making them unhappy? Voting rights. Can't really change that, I think. Can't really change the leadership. And, you know, we're going to stay peaceful for our first contact. We're not really powerful enough to go ham the minute we meet people. Native interference or unrestricted. Yeah, sorry. Leadership. Yeah, can't change that. Can't change that elitism voting voting resettlement allowed. Why is that negative? Are you unhappy about it? Alien slavery. Oh come on, you know you want to be happier. Sheesh. Slightly needy, aren't you? Negative two. Oh god, we need food. Oh balls. Um build. Food, too. Yeah. So they're going to be unhappy for a little bit. That's going to cause a few problems for a while. Um, I'll live, though. Let's go down here. I want to start putting some uh, stations up. Let's put one here. Physics. Sure. Since physics are kind of weakest point right now. Um, all right. How are we doing on our planets? Slowly growing. Very good. Over here. Yay, we finished uh, this one. See, their happiness is pretty good. Oh, maybe I'll just put a governor. I forgot to do that. So, new governor. Gonna recruit another one. We're getting to our limit up here, huh? Uh, yeah. We have four out of five colonized planets, so directly controlled. Interesting. Strategic resources, one out of two. Hmm. Oh, uh, I was getting them a governor. Engineering. Oh, slavery, mineral output, and food output. Yes, please. We actually have our max leaders. Shoot. Okay, so leaders, we need to figure something out. Do we really need an admiral right now? Um, I may get rid of one of our science ships. Busy leading. Okay, so I need our researchers. I can't really get rid of them. Busy, busy commanding anomaly, rocketry, research speed of statecraft, just research bonus. <laughs> They're such high level though, it, it hurts me to kind of get rid of them. <sighs> Leader experience gain. I might keep you just because you get that. Actually, you're the oldest one, so bye bye. Oh, wait, what ship are you on? Vivian. So, Vivian. Where are you at? Oh, you're actually finishing research here. So once you finish researching this, I'll just get rid of the ship and I'll, you know, fire him. Yeah. Wow. Yes, I know you're working on starvation. I wish I could send them food or something, but no. Whoa, why is their habitability so high? Starvation. Oh, that's really depressing. Um, you know, if they could start, you know, working. Research it. 
from all individualist pops. Lovely. They hate me with their guts and life. I wish you told me what the actual happiness level is. 25%. Some percentage multiplied by 10. A negative man number means that the pop is likely they're angry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I feel like a bad person. This population isn't growing for the life of them, are they? So, we can almost make it okay by, you know, building in the next one here. So, we're getting... Are we getting the food there? Yes. Okay, so they do work. Um, I don't see one to get, uh, energy credits, minerals, oh crap, Point 0.8 collected by population, yeah. I don't have any blocks I can put them on, oh shoot, dense jungle, yeah there's nowhere I can put them, um, I'm gonna put another one there and I'm gonna build the next uh, food hydroponics. Have we built a clinic here yet? I think we did. I think that was a clinic. Frontier clinic. I'm gonna cancel that actually. Finished 182 days. I'm gonna cancel it because I want it up here. Uh, Frontier clinic. Plus, it does produce some more. So, we're also gonna build a hydroponics there. So, hopefully, that helps out some. Um, so they're connecting, collecting some of the minerals there. Very badly though. Void clouds. Let's just watch but not interfere. I like how they didn't really have an option there. 90 days. Sure. Oh, there's factions now. Oh, Lord. So I guess it's downhill from now. <laughs> um. Okay, this is our nation's species. No. Uh, contacts. No. Empire. Here we go. Factions. Manage the faction. Grant independence, press the media. Oh my god. Bribe the leaders. Shit. Serves. Intellectual. Emancipated. What happens if I emancipate them? They become loyalists. Accepting robotic populations. So there's robots in here? Oh, that's so cool. Then they, they will never have any. Riots. Oh, God. Defense. So this could go badly. What do they want? Um. Faction support. What are they? Planetary Separatist Faction. Who the hell are you guys? Why does it say they have 20? Attraction. Factoring in trade, ethics, and policies as well as international. Increased happiness makes a pop more likely to become a state loyal. Certain factions will have an infinitely high attraction value to certain pops. Example, slave will always join a slave faction. So they only have one population, actually. I don't know. What happens if I emancipate the slaves? You know, like... I don't know, I'll have to look that up after. Okay, goodbye. Alright guys, this video has been going on for a little longer than I wanted them to. I'm saying I want to keep them about 25 minutes. So, it's, I'm going to call it now. About 30, you know, one of our first videos. I think that's fine. Um, please do hit that like button and subscribe if you like what you've seen, guys. It does uh, mean a lot to me. It shows me that you guys want to keep seeing this series. That you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. And it just shows that, you know, there's actually people out there watching this. Um, also, uh, if you want to, you know, be part of the series, if you want to have your name anywhere, whether you want to be a ship or you want to be a planet or a station, you know, whatever you want, go ahead and just leave a comment and I'll make sure to add you guys into the series. And, you know, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.